The majority of lights have been turned back on in Montgomery County after Hurricane Laura. Entergy's power grid went dark yesterday after rotating outages that residents and business owners didn't know were set to happen. Channel 2's Kathy Hernandez joining us now live with more on those outages. Kathy, good morning. Good morning to you. A sigh of relief for families here in Montgomery County after Intergy now says there will no longer be any more rolling outages like they initially said. It took a while for the house to cool down and whatnot, but we were just so happy and thankful. Trina and her family are thankful to have power today. They were among the more than 100,000 customers in Montgomery County without it for hours yesterday. Energy says the outage would have prevent a more extensive one, possibly affecting the power grid. Energy says it's all because of damage by Hurricane Laura. Many families understand the reasoning behind it, but wish there had been notice. To be honest, I would just wish Energy would have just sent out messages saying that we're doing rolling blackouts. We don't know when they may occur, but at least give people the opportunity to say, well, okay, I need to find somewhere to go just in case for a few hours. Energy did address that specifically in a statement this morning, saying in part, in an emergency situation like this, there was no notice provided to Energy of the pending outage and thus no way for us to inform our customers in advance of the outages. I assure you that these steps were only a last resort measure taken to ensure the overall stability of the electric grid. The reasons behind the cancellations of these rolling outages, they say Energy fixed a high voltage power line last night and have started up units at their power plant on the Texas Louisiana state line. That is good news there. They're also no longer asking customers here to conserve energy. Reporting live in Montgomery County, Kathy Hernandez, KPRC, Channel 2 News. Kathy, thank you.